Hi everyone, and welcome to my unboxing of the AMD Athlon 2 4X635 quad core processor. It runs at 2.9 gigahertz. It's a true quad core design. Two mags of total cache. Socket AM3, and it comes with a heatsink and fan. And there's the chip itself. It comes with cool and quiet, a three-year warranty, a whole bunch of stuff. It's a really cheap processor. I got this for $105 Canadian. I'm gonna use this for a file server, so it's pretty nice. So let's crack it open. I'm gonna do this with one hand because I forgot my tripod in my car. Oh, that's always a card. Okay. So okay, on this side we have the processor and the manual with the case badge. In there. Uh, where's the case badge? Where did the case badge go? Usually they're right there. Maybe they put it in the manual. It's like a quick setup guide. Slash a whole bunch of other stuff. Oh, we'll find the case badge later. Let's take out the heat sink. Let's see what AMD's doing with their heat sinks in there. Yeah, where's my case badge? I got gypped. Damn. <laughs> this heat sink feels actually quite heavy. By the looks of it so far, it looks like a solid chunk of aluminum like they're old heat sinks. It's really hard with one hand. Oh, yeah. So it's a solid chunk of aluminum, or it comes pre-applied thermal paste. Lots and lots of fins compared to their old uh, processors. My last AMD processor I bought uh, for myself was an AMD 3700 3, single core, so it's been a few years. Not bad. This should do good because I'm using this as a file server slash VMware server, so you're doing lots of things like that. And uh, yeah, so and this is the chip itself. This is the socket AM. Three, but it also works on AM2 if you have a board that supports AM2 and AM3, so you could do DDR2 memory on an AM2 motherboard, and on AM3 it supports DDR3, so it's pretty cool. But anyways guys, thanks for checking out my boxing of the AMD Athlon 2 X4 635. See ya!